late push here for number seven, Linga Jess, into six dollars on the fix. Still a little bit longer than that on the toot. And the evens go in and the green light goes on. Here's the G6, grsa.com.au juvenile stake over the 5.15. Favoured out in the 8, no signal. Began okay. Began a little bit quicker than the Linger Jess, but it matches it. But the speed's underneath with Spicy Jill, who tries to get across, but what a wish kicks up on the inside. Spicy Jill went a little wide and leaves what a wish out in front by two or three lengths. Stoking up around the outside, no signal. Then Cutie Lee. Then in turn behind those, going up on the inside to make ground a Linger Jess. Then Barmar McClellan. Clarence still in front. What a wish leads by a length and a half to two lengths. Trying hard is Cutie Lee and Spicy Jill. What a wish in front. Holding on. What a wish is going to be too good. Beats Cutie Lee. Second was Spicy Jill. Fourth placing was a Linga Jess. Uh, then in turn behind those Barmar McLaren and no signal was tailed off about five lengths away at the tail end of the field. The time somewhere around 30 and 40. What a wish. Well, she looked the most excited to see the lure. She jumped pretty good, a 4.49. That's a personal best jump for her, even though she wasn't the leader. She had that inside run to push through and take the lead. And uh, she, well, the other's running a little wide. She was up there vying for the lead, but I think it's fair to say that early split would be to Spicy Jewel or Cutie Lee out wide, but she railed really well. It's 1.5, 4 and 7, 1.5, 4 and 7, 30 and 30.